Hey, how are you? Okay la. <sighs> Surviving lo. <sighs> don't ask, don't ask. How are you? Has got to be one of the most asked questions in the world. And our reply is usually automatic. What do you usually say? Is your reply mostly optimistic or generally pessimistic? When someone asks us how we are, our reply is so casual, we don't even think about it. But in reality, our reply gives us an insight beyond what we feel in that moment. It helps us understand our own perception towards life. For all of us, there are bad days. Days where we feel sad, down, disappointed, and dejected. Yet a bad day isn't a bad life. And when someone asks us how we are, our reply can really determine how we impact our own happiness. Happiness is not thinking positive. Happiness is making a conscious decision to empower what brings positivity into our lives. When we're going through a hard time, or if we don't like our job, or if we simply don't get enough sleep, a pessimistic or sarcastic reply leads us down the path of empowering negativity. This is why when we don't feel good, we can feel worse throughout the day, or it simply never gets better. The practice of happiness isn't about faking positivity or forcing ourselves to be cheerful. The practice of happiness requires us to be self-aware, and that means being aware of our own perception towards life. For example, do you often think that things could be so much better? Or do you think that, oh, it could have been a lot worse? Do you take action to change what you believe isn't right? Or do you usually hold on to anger and blame? Life is always going to be filled with challenges, but we can choose a worldview that is filled with strength, faith, and positivity. This way, when someone asks you, how are you, and you've had better days, you might find yourself saying, oh, I haven't had the best day, but life is still pretty good. When we believe deeply in something, it'll manifest itself as the truth. So if we always take the action to empower positivity into our lives, then no matter what happens, we can still be happy always.